Hi everyone, I'm glad you're here. Thank you for joining me. Many of you have reported that you felt that magnitude 3.3. There was actually three earthquakes. You can see this one, which is not being reported at uh, 14.05. That would have been about 7.05 a.m. And it comes in as a magnitude 1.82. Let's look at the seismic signature right there. All right, then we have this one at 1421, also not being reported. That one comes in as a magnitude 1.96 at 1421. Now that's universal time. So that would have been at 721 a.m. And then we got this one right here. This is at 3.3, supposedly. I come up with a magnitude 2.85. Yeah, a lot lower than what they are saying. Um, they're saying it's a magnitude 3.3, .3, but I, yeah, and it was at uh, 1507 Universal or 807 Pacific Standard Time. Yeah, the, let me show you the uh, moment tensor ball. Yeah, we got the Pacific plate moving, um, yeah, north. You can see how this fault moved north. I want to show you um, the faults in this area also. I don't know what the name of this fault is. I used to have them all listed until my Google Earth got screwed up. I'm going to have to put them back in there. But here you can see Santa Barbara. And the earthquake was up and over here, right along this fault line, which is moving north. Also, interestingly, there's been two more earthquakes since then. A magnitude 1.4, Sierra Madre. And a 1.3, um, Little Creek. I'm probably pronouncing that wrong, but you can see here how it's, yeah, it's moving up towards the, uh, San Andreas fault zone. This is for all earthquakes within the last 24 hours. You can see here that all these earthquakes are not being reported. They do have a 1.4 at Bodfish, but that was at 1357. And then um, Anza, California, a 1.6. Yeah. They may come in later and revise it, downgrade this earthquake. Only 379 people said they felt this earthquake. If it, in fact, was a 3.3, there would have been a lot more that felt it. And the intensity level was 3, pretty much. Well, that one's 2. That one's 2. That one's three, Hermosa Beach, um, down by Long Beach, intensity level two, three, Westlake Village, and Moore Park, intensity level two. So intensity level two and three means it was felt by a few people at rest. They were sitting down or laying down, especially on the upper floors. Delicate suspended objects might have been moving. Now for three, it says felt noticeably indoors but not always recognized as an earthquake standing autos would have been rocking slightly vibration like a passing truck yeah i don't think it was a magnitude 3.3 i could be wrong but yeah 3.3 i think there would have been a lot more people that would have felt it did you feel it um how long did it last what did your pets do how did they react Okay, here on EMSC, it says, felt like two quick, slight jolts, uh, felt in Palms, West um, Los Angeles, around three seconds. Another one said it was a slight bump. Another one heard a few creaks from the building and mild shaking for about eight seconds. Another one said they felt a strong jolt. Their dog was barking crazy. Uh, another one, Culver City. I thought I felt something. I guess I did. Um, Marina Del Rey felt the bed shake slightly. Yeah, it wasn't a 3.3. Just a few seconds jolt. Chandelier sh shook. That came from Los Angeles. Plants moved and a tiny quick shake. Another one said it was a small and quick. 
interesting that there was that one that said there was two shakes. Um, felt brief side to side, like someone was sitting down in a heavy way on the bench next to you. Another one said the house was shaking there in Los Angeles. Small joke, jolt in Hancock Park. Park, getting all tongue tied here. Um, another one said they barely felt it. So this monitor here, I downloaded two different monitors. Let me make this smaller and I'll show you. Yeah, um, there's the one for Santa Barbara. Let me make this one bigger. Uh, let's see. Oops. Okay, and we'll bring it down. And there's the earthquake. Yeah. Not very um, distinct. Let me show you where it's at. Yeah, I'm sure there's more monitors, but I couldn't find them for like Santa Clara or Pasadena. Here's the uh, 3.4. And this is the monitor that showed the earthquakes the best. And this is the monitor for Santa Barbara. If I can get it to click on it. There you go. Yeah, so how long did it last? What did the motion feel like? Was it up and down, circular, um, side to side? Yeah, let me know. Thank you very much for watching. And as always, always be prepared for an earthquake. Please stay safe. And I'll talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.